That's three makes a fiver. No, Cheers. So, you couldn't keep away from the old place, eh? I'm down to see Matt. How is he? What's your good? Neither Susan. Sorry, mate. I promised her I'd call in on Irene while I was down there. I don't need an excuse to come back. There'll always be a welcome for you here on Bridge Street Market. Yeah. Make the effort. Don't be like that, man. Leads is a long way away, I suppose. Yeah. So, uh, what have you been doing with yourself? Well, this morning was horse riding and a cross country run. This evening, the governor's going to lay on a barbecue. I might go if I'm not too tired. Why didn't you get in touch when things started to go wrong? Well, you went to Leeds. You could have phoned us. You didn't have to go. Yeah, but uh, there's no bus. There, there were reasons, okay? Good reasons. What reasons? <laughs> we were happy in Walford. Look, man, even if I'd have stayed in Walford, who's to say things would have been different? You're your own man now. Yeah, but for how much longer? Sarah and Irene, how you been doing, Leah? What are you going to tell them? That I'm having a lovely time making new friends? Why did her mum come, Dad? She, uh, she's not been very well, Max. All this has made her a lot worse. You barely hear us now. And whose fault is that? Yours. None of us wanted to move, but you had to go to Leeds. <laughs> Mum didn't want to go, she wanted to stay. And if she had, we'd have been in Wolford. And none of this would have happened. Man. So don't blame me. 